It is one of the five original wineries on the Lulinaw Peninsula, Willow Vineyards. In tonight's Brewvine, we're taking you there to explore the beautiful setting. It's a wonderful piece of property. It was a lot of fun to develop it. And what we tried to do was we tried to have a nice feeling here, a sense of people wanting to hang out, spend some time. Drive in under beautiful willow trees and you're greeted with a vast view of East Bay and rolling hills of vines here at Willow Vineyards. Probably 15 miles of water and just a heck of a view overlooking the vineyards to the south. But pretty much most of the, the uh, view tends to look toward the east, which is water. From the vines to the tasting room, the owners are most of the crew here, and you'll find them pouring wine almost any day. Not many places the owners are pouring wines for you. We make about 1,400 cases total, and we sell it all right here. So as, as one vintage runs out, we just bring out the next vintage. Here their wines have a drier flavor profile as their roots started out with Chardonnays and Pinot Gris. And later on, they decided to sweeten things up a bit. Those wines were made very dry. We added a dry rosé and we were with four wines for several years until we decided to add the uh, cherry wines and the uh, sweet rain, which is a Chardonnay, which is all Chardonnay and then sweetened up to about 4%. No doubt that with a visit here, you'll learn a lot about the wine culture on the Lulinaw Peninsula, since it took root just like this, with a glass of wine and a beautiful view. It's hard to capture this view because it's such a vast view, mm -hmm. so we're lucky that way that we, you know, we get to hang out here in this wonderful spot. For Bruvine on Lulinaw Peninsula, I'm Charlie Tinker.